Nola Gent here at Cafe Du Monde with some test footage I shot a year ago before the pandemic when I was learning to use a new camera. Welcome to Nola Gent. Let the good times roll. This footage has been locked away in the Nola Gent secret vault for the past year, but I figured now is a great time for all of you out there to see how New Orleans was a year ago at Cafe Du Monde before the pandemic. So my camera work certainly was not the best when I first started uh, experimenting and learning to use this device. And ultimately I decided to use another camera for most of the work that I do these days. But we get a good picture of what it was like before the pandemic. So the line on this side is for to-go orders, not for a table, so don't make a tourist mistake and stand on this side for a table. Strictly for to-go orders on this side. So generally speaking, the line next to the river is for to-go orders, and then any open table you see, you can just take an order. Although, this past weekend for New Year's 2021, I actually saw a line of people on the other side waiting to get a table, which is good news for New Orleans, as we do need our tourists, as that is our main economy. <laughs> I have to say, watching this old footage, that I definitely miss the sound of live music throughout the French Quarter, along with the sounds of crowds of people. We do have a little bit of live music in the French Quarter, but definitely no sounds of large crowds of people like we have in this video still. And before we take a look at the menu, just go ahead and give this video a thumbs up and smash that subscribe button, as it really does help me with the YouTube algorithm. So we have beignets, three pieces to an order with powdered sugar for $3.40. Beverages, cafe au lait, coffee and chicory with hot milk, black coffee and chicory, decaf coffee au lait, and decaf black coffee and chicory. So all of those coffees with a regular for $2.94 and a large for $4.30. Hot chocolate, regular $2.94, a large for $4.30. Orange juice, a regular for $2.94, a large for $4.30. Coke, Diet Coke, Sprite, a regular $2.94, a large $4.30. Cold milk, white art chocolate, a regular for $2.94, a large for $3.40. And then we have bottled water with $2.94. An iced coffee, all they are black, regular $4.30, large $5.43. A frozen cafe au lait, regular $5.43, large $8.34. And then you can have your coffee served in a keepsake mug. So you can have the archway for $7.92 or a souvenir for $6.56. And prices do not include sales tax. And most importantly, cash only. Make sure you bring your cash. I have not yet made a return visit to Café Du Monde since the strict shutdown lockdowns ended in New Orleans. And Café Du Monde is now reopened. Uh, but if it's anything like the rest of the city, most likely all of those prices are going to be more expensive now. Thank you. So I managed to capture my server bringing me the water, but I missed her bringing my food. Cafe Du Monde, $7. Four, Cafe Olay, and beignets. Water's for free. So as a 
little confession. I'm really not that crazy about beignets. I've been eating the beignets and drinking the coffee since I was a tiny little kid, but I just really don't like the powdered sugar on them. So I didn't eat all of these. I uh, boxed them up and uh, gave them to one of my friends later. And usually when I am in the mood for them, I order them minus the powdered sugar because as you look down here, the powdered sugar gets everywhere and Cafe Du Monde is covered in powdered sugar everywhere. So I started drinking coffee at a very young age, and I remember uh, as a child in Café Du Monde frequently getting in arguments with the service staff about how I wanted my coffee black with no milk, and they would always argue with me that it was too strong, and it was coffee like I'd never had before, and I couldn't handle it. But in the end, I always got my black coffee. But these days, I'd usually get it with the milk. So, you know, you get a little older, change things up. And then next, we move into the very dark days of when everything was shut down in New Orleans and Café Du Monde was completely closed and deserted like I've never seen it before. As Café Du Monde is a 24-7 operation. So these were extremely sad times during the peak of the pandemic lockdowns. And it is so good to have it back up and running now. So a place that sells mainly cafe au lait and beignets doesn't have the most extensive menu to review, although the people watching is unbeatable. So let me know below with a comment if you would like me to do another review of the reopened Café Du Monde as it is now. Sadly, many places are not reopening and I do have some of my favorites such as Mubar, that I couldn't even get a picture of with the sign up, unfortunately, they closed so fast. And then, a real heartbreak was K. Paul's Louisiana Kitchen. This is where Paul Prudhomme really brought all of the Cajun cooking to most of America. If you've got a Cajun restaurant in your neighborhood, you can probably blame it on Paul Prudhomme and his K. Paul's Louisiana Kitchen. What a loss to New Orleans this is. I really love this place. And it is a heartbreaking loss to so many of us here in New Orleans. And then St. Charles Tavern was another really hard loss. They've been in business for 103 years. Just like Café Du Monde, this was a 24-7 place. And it had survived Katrina, although it sold to a new owner. The pandemic closed it down and it's currently up for sale and deserted waiting for something to happen. Sadly, we lost many more in 2020 with too many to list in this video and possibly even more still to close that we don't know about. There is some good news with a few places we thought that were gone forever that are reopening. But let's just keep in mind that 2020 and 2021 are not going to be good for many people. So let's keep supporting these places that we can. Thanks for watching. I really appreciate it. And if you would just click on the little circle here with a picture of my head in there and subscribe to the Nolajet channel, it would really help me a lot. I really appreciate it. Thank you.